What's going on everybody? Welcome back to another video. So over the weekend, I was actually making changes to my network and changing my Wi-Fi name and in doing so, it made all of course my Amazon Echo devices go offline and so I had to reconnect those and I thought, you know what, this might be a good time to make a quick video on how to reconnect or change your Wi-Fi network on your Echo device. So that's what we're gonna do in today's video. We're gonna show you how to go in and put the Echo system into a setup mode and then where you go with inside the app. I'm gonna be doing this on Android, but we're gonna go inside the app. I'm gonna show you how to change that Wi-Fi network in case you need to move yours over. So now, of course, at any point during this video, if you get something out of it, you find it useful, be sure to like, share, and subscribe. Uh, those help the YouTube algorithm and help us grow our channel, so that would be much appreciated. You can also support us going over to shop.helpcloud.com that you may find something over there that you enjoy, so be sure to check that out. So with that being said, let's head on over to the desk and get started. So process is pretty straightforward. We're gonna go ahead and open up the Amazon Alexa app. Uh, she's got a currently a red ring because I have it muted so it doesn't react uh, to that name. But go ahead and open up your Amazon app and then you're gonna tap on the little devices, which is the little house down there along the bottom. Go ahead and tap on that and you're gonna tap on where it says Echo and Alexa up in the top left-hand corner. So we're gonna tap on that one more time, and you're gonna to wanna to locate whatever device it is that you have named. So if you have them named, you're gonna figure out which one it is. Um, if you didn't name them, it might be just a trial and error. Um, I did rename them, I know this one is the Office, so we're gonna come on down to the Office and tap on the Office Dot. Uh, now from here, it's gonna load the basically the overall configuration of the Echo Dot but at the very bottom you've got a status option that says wi-fi network and bluetooth go ahead and tap on it and then right here at the middle of the page you should have an option that says wi-fi network uh, and then it'll have the network name underneath it and you're going to tap on where it says change right over there on the right hand side so we're going to tap on change and we're just going to follow the on-screen instructions from here so it says press and hold the action button which is going to be the dot right here so we're going to press and hold this says it for about 15 seconds in order to put it into setup mode. Now in setup mode you'll get a response. In your app. So you'll get a response saying that you are in uh, setup mode. We can tap on continue. It's gonna say searching for device, select your Amazon Echo. It should pop up under the available devices here. Uh, you know it's in setup mode because it's got the circling orange light going around. We're gonna tap on Echo Dot. That'll have a random name that'll be completely random, a separate from what mine was named. Now it's gonna say searching for your Wi-Fi. It's gonna scan all of the different type of Wi-Fi networks that you currently have. And then from here, you are going to just choose your new Wi-Fi. You will want to have the password for it because there's a chance that you may need to type it in. Sometimes it will pull the password from the device, but most of the time you'll need to type it in manually. So we're just gonna go through here and I'm just going to choose the uh, drop, it, drop it like it's hotspot, connecting to Wi-Fi, make sure the device is nearby. So in this case, it did pull the password from my uh, device. If yours does not, and it does ask for a password, be, just be sure to type it in. And then you can just tap on continue, and you've officially changed the Wi-Fi network on your dot. And again, uh, you can see that we went back to the configuration where it has the red because it's muted. Um, and if I wanted to go back in and change it again, you could just change it again and just repeat that process. So yeah, that is all there is to it. Really easy to do. Now this should work for most uh, of the generations one through basically four. The Echo Show systems are a little bit different. You still can put them in setup mode and go through the app and change them that way. But at least these specific instructions should work for virtually any generation of the Echoes and Echo Dots. So um, other than that, that's gonna wrap it up for this week's video. Thank you guys all so much for watching. Thank you guys for what you've done and the support you've given us throughout the years. If you are having some issues and you're struggling, please reach out down in the comments below and I'll answer those as soon as I can. So, so that being said, thank you guys all again for watching and we'll see you on the next one. Peace.